Unveiling both Met Gala Revenue Streams, from Instagram sponsorship to million-dollar ads. The Met Gala, renowned for its extravagant fashion and A-list attendees, serves as a crucial fundraiser for New York's Metropolitan Museum of Arts Costume Institute. Despite its philanthropic nature, Vogue, the event's long-standing organizer, has adeptly leveraged its massive exposure for monetization. Following the cancellation in 2020 and a record-breaking 2021 edition that garnered $16.4 million in revenue, the gala remains a hot topic, particularly amidst the digital transformation challenging traditional print media and fashion advertising. Notably, the red carpet segment, a prime opportunity for brand visibility, has been monetized since 2015, with Vogue offering advertising space. With the proliferation of digital channels, advertising costs have surged, exemplified by the recent sale of two livestream ad slots for $1 million each. Moreover, influencer and celebrity endorsements on platforms like Instagram, a key sponsor of the event, further amplify the gala's reach and revenue potential. Vogue's Libblog emerges as a significant revenue stream, featuring live updates and public voting for standout outfits while hosting high-value advertisements. The cost of these ads is justified by the Met Gala's immense media value, which has surpassed the Super Bowl in recent years. With a live broadcast attracting 16.5 million viewers and an additional 8.2 million views on event-related content in the subsequent three days, advertisers eagerly invest in this prime opportunity. Beyond advertising, the gala generates funds for performances through exclusive ticket sales. Priced at $35,000 per ticket and $200,000 to $300,000 per table, as highlighted by the Evening Standard. In 2015, rumors swirled of Yahoo shelling out $3 million to secure attendance, showcasing the gala's evolution from its humble beginnings with $1,000 tickets in 1995 under Winter's direction.